uh, this movie divides people. <laughs> like yeah. we had a conversation. I had a conversation with my husband. Said, "Whose side are you?" I, and I, I understand that Will's uh, uh, character, and I understood your character too. Did it kind of create a conversation between the two of you two regarding whose side will you be? Co constantly. Constantly. Yeah. I mean, it's ongoing. We still yeah. have it, and it, yeah. it's not so much whose side will you be on, right. but. Um, uh, shall we say the sort of motivations, intentions, uh, conversations about shame, conversations about truth, conversations about gender, uh, family. It, it, it generates a lot of different kinds of conversations, which I, is what I love about the film. And it changes, uh, I, I think, every time you see the movie. Yeah. Uh, the, the, we just saw it at Sundance with an audience. And yeah. My, my recollection of my feeling when I first saw the movie was, um, I'm just not on Pete's side. I don't think he did the honorable thing at all. Mm -hmm. When I watched it this last time, all of a sudden I had some empathy for, you know, he still doesn't make the right decision, but and I just felt bad for him. And, yeah. and, but I think that's gonna evolve and change mm -hmm. as, as you watch this. Yeah, and uh, Julia, you're also a producer here. How is it having two hats, and why did you choose Will to be your partner in this movie? Um, well... Careful. <laughs> you're on record. <laughs> um, Will was really our last choice, <laughs> to be honest. You don't mind my saying I that, don't, do I don't, I don't mind. I, I, I had... Literally everyone stalked else, you guys yeah, to try to do he had stalked, and, yep. and and so we, you know, at a yeah. certain point, you just sort of give in to it. It was a battle of attrition. <laughs> um, actually, um, I was a huge fan of Will's, uh, obviously, just generally speaking, and I was also very familiar with the work that he did in Stranger Than Fiction, which was sort of more of a dramatic role, and uh, I thought, oh man, he's like the perfect guy. I hope he is interested, and it turns out he was, yes. so we lucked out. Mm -hmm. And this is your first time to work with Julia, too? First time. Yeah. First so. time, first time even meeting each other. Yeah. Uh, we, we, we were just laughing when we sat down to talk about the script and the movie that we hadn't even crossed paths, you know, just incidentally. And uh, so this was like a dream come true on so many levels to, to get to work with an amazing person like Julia and also just to with this material and this you know beautiful cast and crew in all on location it was mm -hmm. it's something we're all really proud of mm -hmm. and what did you think about the lesson for our married couples about <coughs> this, you know, doing the movie what what is the best lesson that the movie gives to married couples mm. what's the best lesson well one I mean it's okay to admit immediately that you're wrong <laughs> uh, I think ownership yeah. of, of uh, taking responsibility yeah. for um, uh, bad behavior yes. is a very good step in uh, reconciliation. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very good. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah.